What's good, YouTube? Before we go any further, make sure you guys hit that like button and hit that subscribe button. I appreciate y'all if you're already subscribed. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button, man. Don't be a hater. Let's go. What's happening, YouTube? Real quick, another wild situation for y'all. Another wild story. This video is a. Uh, it's about Jay Diggs, man. You know, I dropped the video about him signing a, a rapper that was an upstate Southsider and whatnot, right? Well, he responds to my video. I posted it in my community post. I'm pretty sure like some of you guys, probably a lot of you guys seen it. But his response to my video was saying that everything in my video was all lies. Pretty much that it never happened. It was pretty much BS, all kept. Well, uh, I'm here to say to y'all, because I had a lot of super... Uh, J Dig super fans in my comments saying, "Oh, I knew it wasn't true, or I knew this was cap." <laughs> Look, bro, I'm calling cap on what J Dig said. Like it, J the, this signing a Sereno is a hundred percent facts, bro. Point blank, period. I don't know what J Diggs is saying. You know, there is certain things I got wrong in my video, maybe a lot of things, but the overall. The overall of the story is Jay, the Thiz label signing a Southsider, a Sereno from Upstate. That's facts. It's so much facts that I have a very special guest coming on the platform that is a highly influential individual from this Latin era. From this Latin. A highly influential individual from this latin he's gonna be on the platform i'm gonna do an interview and i'm gonna let him tell the exact story on what exactly happened he's gonna give all the facts now you guys are not gonna want to miss this interview it's gonna be a dope interview it's gonna be history it's gonna be northern california history hip-hop history for the northern california movement involving the late great mac drace this nation this whatever you know what i'm saying the whole this label Anything involving this has to go back to Mac Dre, and we have to pay homage to the late, great, rest in peace, Mac Dre. Even though Mac Dre wasn't around for the Thiz Latin era, we still have to pay homage to him, because without Mac Dre, a lot of this shit wouldn't have had happened. So, I need you guys to turn your notification bells on, hit that little uh, bell right there next to the subscribe button, hit turn on all notifications, and join the notification gang, you feel me? You guys join the gang, man, notification gang. Once I drop the video, you guys will get notified. Check it out, bro. It's someone highly influential within the Thiz Latin movement. He's going to explain the breakdown, the history on how Thiz Latin started with Go Toes and all the homies out there from the Bay connecting with the homies in the Valley and vice versa, bro. It's going to be deep. It's going to be detailed. You don't want to miss this history lesson right here, bro. So hit that notification bell. Join the notification gang. Stay locked in. It's going to be dropping tonight. Well, I don't know whenever you drop this video. If this video, if the interview already happened, just go to my tab. On, just go to my channel. Go to the uh, playlist tab. And I will have it right there under interviews. If the interview already happened. If the interview hasn't happened yet, turn on your notification bells and wait for it to happen. You know what I'm saying? Because the interview is going to go down. It's going to be dope. You don't want to miss it. It's going to be a history lesson. You're going to learn something from it. Maybe something you didn't know about Go Toes and other rappers coming out of Northern California. Jay Diggs, uh, uh, um, Kilo Kurt, and all the guys from Thiz. How Thiz Latin started in the first place. Who was the first artist from this Latin? We're going to get into it, bro. So make sure you guys hit the like button, hit your notification bell, and join the notification gang, and stay locked in. You feel me? It's the kid, and I'm gone.